Uh, Alien Ann Production Series. So, uh, just a couple of minutes ago, Anna Fury episode 6 aired, and I'm gonna be reviewing it. Let's get into this video. So, this episode, like, featured the debut of, um, the Dino Fury Megazord with the Pink Rangers, like, um, key in the middle. This probably is gonna be its only exclusive appearance, because in Rue Soldier, like, it hardly appeared, like, because you guys know in Rue Soldier, like, um, you can, like, put different, like, Rue souls in, like, the head. So, yeah, the Pink Ranger soul was in the head of the of the Dino Fury Megazord today. It's probably gonna be and never gonna appear in Dino Fury again. Well, like, um, it's, yeah, so then... The episode is a Pink Ranger focused episode. Like she had like bad luck because she walked under a ladder. Then like she found a Sporix. Um, so this was I couldn't remember what episode. I think this is an episode eight of Rear Soldier. I'm not sure. I think this is adapting episode eight. I'm not sure. Um, because it just came a couple minutes ago. So like um, we got like to see um, so like it, it, we got to see like um like boom tower like he took the dino fury morpher from the pink ranger and then like it was broken but then he fixed it then like um so like they just made a new morpher for the pink ranger even though if they got the old morpher back i wonder what they're gonna do with it maybe make a new ranger who knows uh who, who knows they might make an original ranger out of that so like um we also got to see the um like uh this episode um Featured, like, um, so, like, the, um, monster, I couldn't remember the name of it, but, like, okay. So, in, the, like, villains, like, um, they were, like, um, so, like, Void Knight, like, was hardly having an appearances in this episode. It was just, like, he only briefly appeared, like, in the base, Area 62. So then, um... So then, like, it was, the the Pink Ranger's grandpa, like, she, he was, um, like, got, like, um... Tell, told her that, like, she was gonna have bad luck by walking under a ladder. Then, like, at the end of the episode, um, like, we see the Green Ranger in one of her arm modes. Um, it's mainly used by the Blue Ranger in Ryu Soldier. I, yeah. So, like, she took, um, the Sporix, because, like, the different Sporix, like, they can revive. So, I have a feeling, like, okay, the next, like, if we get, like, because the, some of the, re um, Minosaurs in Ryu Soldier, like, like, some of the, the, the Minosaurs in Rio Soldier actually, like, came back in later episodes. So, like, the ones that appear only in one episode, like, get, like, the Sporks, they're taken, like, in their counterpart in America gets taken by, um, their American counterpart gets, like, taken by the, 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 the Fury Rangers. The ones that Boy Knight still has are, uh, are they gonna appear in later episodes, so yeah. And then, apparently, um, so, like, then we got, like, to see this, um, so it was mostly, like, most of the fight scenes in this episode were, like, original footage. Like, it was hardly any Sentai footage. And then, like, um, we got one morphing sequence of red, blue, green, and black. Like, it was just the male morphing sequence. I know green's a female, but, like, it was the male Ryu Soldier counterpart. And then, like, um, so the, um, and then, like, the... Yeah, so that's pretty much gonna do it for this episode. I know it's a short review, because I just I just came from watching it, so yeah, I'm just gonna do a short review. Thank you all for watching, and I'll see you in the next video. Goodbye.